When your MacBook Pro is not so pro anymore, you can't even plug in your lightning cables or your USB standard plugins? Welp, that's where this FTLL Type-C hub comes in handy. My cousin who happened to have bought this MacBook Pro for $1800 can't even plug in his iPhone natively. Here comes an adapter for that dongle life. This thing feels good, like high, pretty high quality. Oh yeah, feels like actual aluminum. It sort of matches the color of the screen and the gray. The hub has two USB 3.0s with the Type-C plug and an HDMI output. Hey, does this come with the editing software at all? And of course that moment when your Apple fanboy of a cousin doesn't know exactly how to use Mac OS. But it's not his fault. Some people aren't tech savvy, but that's what they got me for. Unlike the iPhone, I do not need to use the hub. I can plug in the straight type C plug right into the Mac. So you can charge from any port now and stuff? Yep, any port. So of course the hub allows you to bridge all your other cables that does not have USB type C or your lightning cable, of course. So you can plug in external hard drives. Oh, how'd you do that? Plug in controls nice. for gameplay, card readers. Plug all this stuff in. Uh because you need this. You know, normal stuff like a normal computer with all those USB plugins. Plug in the HDMI for... What does that plug in do? The monitor? <laughs> oh yeah, it does come on. Oh, there you go. You are showing that on the other camera? Yeah, it's on here. Oh. <laughs> Silly Billy Nilly. So you need this. To do this. Yeah, see, this loads up fine. Of course, it works perfectly. I had no issues. It's a device that maybe some of you did not know that exists. And quite possibly you're thinking about which one should you buy. This one works great. As you can tell, it's very useful here. And now let me show you what you can do with it on your phones. Okay, so now that you've seen that this adapter, the dongle life, is very useful for a MacBook Pro that is not so pro anymore. So you would need to rely on something like this to convert on certain things. Because it's kind of funny how the iPhone does not have USB Type-C, but the MacBook Pro is all about USB Type-C, which your Android phone has it. So I'm going to go ahead and plug this Type-C in here. Option to charge this device, supply power to another device, transfer files, transfer photos, and use device as MIDI. 1% left about to die and this is something that the iPhone cannot do with USB type C to another USB type C port you do not need a hub but the hub allows me to have multiple plugins like we can plug this in here and I'll be able to charge the iPhone with my pixel with my Android phone so plug that in and you can see charge so now my battery right here is giving charge it doesn't stop there another example not saying that you have to go no wired, you got this light up keyboard that's gonna be able to function on my phone here. So now I can go ahead and start typing here. As you see, the V20 is also USB type C. Same scenario as the Pixel, plug that right in, it'll charge the iPhone. And this will do some receiving all the data and everything's on this phone, which can be transferred back and forth. And again, plugging in the HDMI to this, V20 has native support for HDMI display. iPhone's being charged. V20 on right there. My monitor, right? Smooth transitions from the phone that you can do it all here with this little hub. And there you guys have it. As you can tell, this is very useful. This is something that you might be looking forward to. And if you want it for yourself, check it out in the description down below. And as always, thank you for watching. And I will see you guys next time. Later.